Hi Sagittarius, it's L here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Do like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Sag with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what's going on for love, Sagittarius. What's going on for love? Take the leap of faith into the unknown. So it's like jumping out of the frying pan into the, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You jumping out of the front, something is hot. Something is getting too, to be too much here. And it's like, you're just going to jump into something that you just don't know what it's going to turn into, but you know, you need to follow your heart's desire and manifest the heck out of your life. It's like you have some dreams, some aspirations, and you need to go after it. It's like something is holding you back and you're scared. Yeah, love yourself as much as you want your soulmate to love you. Maybe you've been giving away so much love, so much devotion, so much everything that you don't even have that for yourself. There's no reserve for yourself. Your person could even pick up on this. You care too much. You love them more than they love you. Oh, uh, I will walk 500 my, Where is this coming from? This person feels like you would do anything for them or that they, they feel like you have, they have you wrapped around their finger. It says peace comes from within. Do not seek it without. Maybe you're, you're wanting somebody to be your peace or wanting someone to be that person that you can run to. But you have to be peaceful within yourself. There's a war going on within you because there is some side you need to choose. There's a decision you need to make. You need to cut something off and bring something in or you need to cut something off and move to this place or take that leap of faith. Let's see what's going on for you, Sagittarius. Oh, shit. Somebody talks too much. Okay. That could be you. Um, I heard like it's like an immature energy. Somebody talks too much, talks really loud. It's always going. Um... Let's see, somebody could be jealous of you here too. What's going on here for Sagittarius? Yeah, you're just in need of new friends, new real friends. Somebody is not showing up in the capacity of caring, a caring nature. They don't care what happens. They don't care about you, okay? Um, what's going on? Yeah, hook up on the weekend. I don't know if somebody like stepped out of the relationship or somebody wants to step out of the relationship. Maybe when you leave, somebody hooks up, you know, on the, on the weekend, the health of the relationship is declining or maybe somebody's health is declining. Uh, somebody blocked you on all social media or you blocked somebody. Somebody is not only sleeping with other people, but maybe even getting paid for doing so, or this is what pe you do. You engage with these type of energies. You could be having some vivid dreams about what's going on. Your intellect, your psychic abilities are being heightened right now. There could have been a physical fight between you and someone that you love um, or that you like or that you thought you were going to be with. Um, what, is, what is going on here? What is going on? One more card for Sagittarius. It just was like from bad to worse yeah promiscuity is coming out again this could be with a feminine energy or someone just doesn't know how to someone isn't smart okay um someone doesn't know how to love they don't love themselves also somebody could be in need and maybe that's why they're sticking with you or clinging to you let's see what's going on for you in career and finance sagittarius what's going on okay keep the faith and whatever you're doing Whatever you're engaging in, keep the faith. Things will turn around for you, uh, especially in your, if you're in some spiritual work or you do spiritual work, relationship dynamics. Uh, maybe some relationship has changed, has altered, has shifted in terms of uh, your career. Maybe you're making new alliances or, uh, <clears throat> yeah, or you're getting, yeah, new alliances is what I'm hearing. All right, leave it there. Get some rest. Some of you are overworking or you, you, um, you're not you're sleeping but you're not resting you know you, you go to sleep because you know you need the sleep so you can get up and do the same thing over and over again yeah your intellect your 
psychic abilities, your intuition is really speaking to you about maybe maturing, going to the next level. You're realizing something that maybe there is no chemistry. There's a false sense of you need to welcome something new, maybe in your career, your finance a sector or you need to do something new an end of an era is happening here maybe the era of you i don't know doing something going back and forth um not making a decision um the rain is over is what i heard maybe you're not the top dog anymore or you just feel like you just need to institute or bring in to bring something new to your business yeah um oh i heard overzealous overzealous the devil card um this also could be over, something over, overspending, overdoing it, over talking because somebody's got to talk too much. Maybe you're doing that in your career and finance. Um, make sure that you don't make extravagant choices. OK, um, some of you could be into the tarot or esoteric judgment here. So it's like the universe really asking you to forgive, to relinquish, to let go of maybe some addictive nature, some toxicity, sexual addiction, um, get help, seek help with the judgment card. Pick a side is what I'm hearing. The universe is saying do so. Yeah, because something could put you in a place of rest where you're going to have to settle down and sit down. They could have something to do with your health also. These carefree sexual connections, be, be, be cautious, be careful because it can feel fun in the beginning. It can feel like it's going well and then it could be disharmony. Wow. As I say that the five of cups, something could change or shift your fortune. It could be you just being aligned with the wrong person or the wrong persons. Something could cause a death or a death in your finances or something changes. It's like you start something, but it's not fortunate and you're disappointed because you got the advice of the cards to institute something new. Uh, be of a new mindset, be, uh, be renewed also with the judgment card here. So it's like bring something new up in within you because the end of an era is here for you. Something that you do as you started as a hobby, maybe you monetize it now. You might need to retire this, let it go. You're stronger than you know, shift something because if you don't, your finances are going to go down. Something's going down here. This is, this could be, I don't know if you do something that's kind of taboo for money or sell drugs, have sex for money. I don't know. You might want to shift that. That's what I have for you, Sag. I hope that it resonates. Go over to the website book there. And someone around you could be doing this taboo thing. Go to the website, book your own personal reading, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Learn the Tarot with me. The, the classes are linked below. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.